Hello everybody, this is Maximus McCullough, your Google Website Pro Advisor. Okay, so now we have several different things uh, with the Google AdSense and uh, DFP for publishers, but let, let me go take you to a website that we've done. It's called the DIY Show Off, okay? Now, whenever you first go onto this site and you look around, you'll see that there's several different ads uh, on the site. We, ha we have an ad here, we have an ad, we have more ads down is f further down we go on the page okay so now uh, uh, Rochelle wanted to maximize her potential or her revenue for her ads okay so what she did was is enroll in DFP now what DFP is is she has Home Depot, Lowe's, Home Media Publishers and Google AdSense all within this website so who's ever ad pays the most it's the one that gets displayed the most okay so she maximizes her uh, revenue off of these this this DFP okay so how you have to get a, a double click for publishers account you, ha you first you have to have a Google AdSense account so if you haven't started that click on my tutorial about how to set up a Google AdSense account after you do that then watch this tutorial so what we're gonna do is we're gonna type DFP into the Google search engine just like this now I don't like to be around the bush a lot so I'm just gonna tell you directly what you need to do okay because whenever first people come to come to this it gets really confusing and really cumbersome because there's so many different things to do it so I am going to show you how to do it the simplest way possible okay so th uh, this uh, particular person here has not had a Google AdSense account so I signed her up for one and we're waiting for her to be approved after she's approved she'll click get started now whenever you have a DFP account and you sign into it it looks like this there's not going to be any orders down here there's not going to be any information now I'm going to show you what to do one step at a time there's there's a few different steps so if you don't have uh, 10 or 15 minutes I would have to say you know pause this video and come back and watch it later but I'm going to show you how to do it the easiest most painless way possible one of the things that I will tell you, if you're only going to display Google AdSense ads, there is no reason to have DFP, okay? If you're only going to display Google Ads. Now, one of the things that you want to do, you'll have your Google AdSense account, of course, but maybe you'll go to a, a, a site and sign up for these affiliates accounts, or, or let's say GoogleWebsitePro.com, uh, the website here. So we have uh, careers and we have affiliates. Okay, so we have a, an opportunity for affiliates to make money with their uh, website. Okay, they fill out this little form and then they can get a banner. And this little banner here, they can pick up their, pick which size they want, the 300 by 250, 336 by 280, and so on. But they would take this and, you know, double click this code and put it into one of their ads here. Okay, so that either way maybe a Google AdSense ad will display or a Google Website Pro ad will display or maybe that you've signed up for different affiliates that are you know throughout the internet you can find them all over the place where you get a kickback so that's what this DFP is all about so if you grasp that concept let's go on to the, the second step and I'm going to show you everything about this uh, on how to, to insert uh, an order ad how to get your code and then put it in your website